Okay, so we woke up and had some breakfast. We made some avocado toast, which was tasty. And so good. Now we are walking to a beach. It says on app maps it's a beach, but we'll see if it's any different from the spot we were at yesterday. And we're just gonna walk around and enjoy our morning. The mornings here are so quiet and peaceful. It's so nice to just wake up and walk around in a very quiet, nice looking town. I don't know, something about it is magical. we were going to was just rocks <laughs> and so it wasn't very pleasant to just sit at so instead we found this nice little place to stand in the water and look well, at see, the views you can see the people in the background they're at the beach yeah but so. this little part we're at is just as big and, and there's nobody it's the same else, thing so. So. <laughs> oh well it's nice literally everywhere so we're not complaining <laughs> We're just wandering around and we found the city hall in the unique sea field. Like, no, it just looks like somebody's apartment building. <laughs> <laughs> We're looking for coffee and tea at a cafe, but there's no cafes here. And so we asked a local guy where we could find something and he told us all about his mission work in Bangladesh and Brazil and <laughs> it was a very cool conversation. So now we're going to the little restaurant he recommended. So we came to get coffee and if you just order like a black coffee it in, a, in Italy they'll give you one shot of espresso black. So that's what we got. It's pretty so <laughs> I'm going to order like a cappuccino or something better okay so we spent the afternoon working we made a little lunch and now we're headed to a dinner spot which is about 40 minutes walking away we were gonna take the bus but the bus system here is so terrible and so I think they just shut down today because there are no buses currently running that's okay we uh, we're gonna enjoy the walk it's so scenic and pretty I feel like I've said that in every video we've recorded so far, but we don't even mind walking around. And like being in a mountain town, like when I see a mountain, my first instinct is that I want to climb to the top of it. <laughs> <laughs> and we haven't done any hiking here, so I'm excited. Leaving Colono. Our luck has run out and the pathway stopped, so now we're about to brave the busy road. Unfortunately. Car. Big bus coming. We're in our gag now. Do you like walking on the roads? Oh. Yeah, we haven't gotten used to it yet, and we've been doing it for like 30 minutes. <laughs> okay, we're just getting into Argegno. Argegno, we don't know how to say it. And it's so beautiful. We see all these little towns peppered all over the coast. But it's not until you get up close to them that you can see how uniquely beautiful each one of them is. Okay, we passed a cable car going up to the top of the one of the mountains and now this is definitely not it. We're trying to find where it is. We're not 
being very successful at the moment. We found it, but the last run is at 6.55 and it is now 7.07. 7 7. This is the saddest day of And it says it's mandatory to wear a mask and we don't even have masks. Well, I might have one in the bag, but anyway. Now back to our regularly scheduled program of finding a restaurant to eat at. <laughs> How sad are you that we can't go up the cable car? I'm so sad. I'll just have to dream about the views from the top of the mountains now. <laughs> so we found this cute little restaurant. And if you order a drink, you get this little charcuterie spread. <laughs> so we got an Aperol Spritz, which is like the drink of Italy or something. I don't know. Never had it before. <laughs> It's good. Fresh? It is. Yeah, it's really good. They had an extra table outside that cleared out, so they told us we could move outside to this little table, and we have a nice view, and there's a nice breeze, and it's awesome. <laughs> Okay, so we got this gelato from the place next door to the restaurant. We thought that it was closed at 7, but it is now 8.30 and they're still not closed. So this is called Cremino, or Cremino maybe? And it's like a hazelnut mixture with chocolate. Oh my gosh. So good. So good. Our dilemma now is do we walk back the whole way or do we find someone to ride with? <laughs> AKA hitchhike. <laughs> We've never hitchhiked before, so if we do, it's gonna be an adventure. We'll see. Maybe it'll be a fun experience. It's pretty, well, it's not like normal here, but like, it seems more common to hitchhike here than in like the US. It's also just like if they're going that direction they have to be going to the town we're in. So Because our town is the next town over so it's like if you're driving that way might as well just drop us off. We'll see. We tried hitchhiking for about five minutes and it did not work so we gave up and now we're just walking. <laughs> to be fair we didn't try for that long but it's about to get dark, so we're just like, we just need to at least start walking so we don't get stuck in the dark. The road is less busy now than it was earlier though. That's good at least. We are the last ones on the lake tonight. Not a single other boat. How does that make you feel? Uh, yeah, it was really nice. I'm definitely glad we brought it down. We went out like twice as far as we went, did twice as far as we went yesterday and just sort of sat and enjoyed the peace and quiet, so. Yay! Yeah. And? And it's my birthday today. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a great birthday. 22, it's gonna be hard to top this one. <laughs> <laughs> Lake Como, baby. The place of dreams. We love carrying paddle boards up these hills. 